Good morning, my lovely people, and happy Tuesday. It is currently 6.52 a.m. I've been up since around 4.45 because my bestie is traveling overseas and they were at the airport <clears throat> and they ended up calling me so we had a cute call. Um, so that really got me to like wake up and stay up. I would have go back to bed but I'm up now so we're gonna get ready for a run. I've actually been pretty productive while on the call as well but we had a really nice catch up. They're not traveling to me, they're traveling overseas somewhere else so really jealous so I'm super excited to like see them when they get home. But oh I am a little bit tired. <clears throat> I am a little bit burnt as well because I didn't put the sunscreen on yesterday. Silly goose. Um I think I'm gonna head out for a run this morning. <clears throat> I'm a bit hungry, that's the only thing. I'm just editing some YouTube. Now I edited one video, which I'm so glad about. <laughs> I did some TikTok editing. And yeah, that's pretty much all I've done, but I'm actually a little bit tired now. Now I'm like saying that I'm tired. I'm tired. Anyways, let's put you on my YouTube or my TikTok vlog. Oh my gosh. Alright, so I don't know what's happening today, but I do want to go to the gym earlier today. Um, I want to use their ice baths again because it was so good. It was so good. And I want to do that again today. I have a week pass. Like, I may as well just, like, use it up. I know I'm not going to be training on Thursday. That's why I want to do it today. If not, I can go tomorrow. Tomorrow's Wednesday. I have a free day tomorrow as well. So, I do have two free days that I want to utilize it a lot. I have a massive day Thursday. Friday, I don't really have much. Saturday, and then Saturday, I leave to go home. So, it's been a really quick trip. And I was talking to my friend just then. And I was like, I, I can see myself moving here one day. And I think. I think being here more and more each day. I don't feel lonely. I feel so lonely when I'm in Australia. I know I have so many friends. I have so many beautiful friends. But I just don't feel lonely here. I feel really productive. I, I still talk to my friends obviously. But I don't feel as much like FOMO when I'm in Australia. Like I mean I don't feel much FOMO when I'm here in Bali than I do in Australia. Which is pretty weird but it doesn't matter <laughs> anyways we're gonna get ready to go for a little let's get my steps in for today and we'll go eat brekkie <laughs> alright let's get it I'm such a bad vlogger I've been not taking my camera because it's just like too much to carry so i did a bit of shopping today i'll do a haul when i get back but i got my hair done and now it's not curly because the stupid weather mm, it's still kind of but i got a haircut first time in like forever and now i'm getting a massage treating myself because tomorrow is like such a long day and i just want to feel relaxed and then go to bed early tonight because i did not go to bed early enough and yeah, I'm also thinking about booking this place. <laughs> it's like 1k and I'm like, I should just do it. But I'm gonna get a massage and I'll see you guys. Okay, back from a massage <laughs> and I'm back on the camera. So today I went to this shop called um, Olatu. It's handmade Balinese lace and it is so pretty. It's all handmade. So my mum bought me a couple of stuff. So they had these two tops, it came in a pack, this is the first one, it's just a black, black one, it's so, it feels so good, it's so like breathable and airy, it's just amazing, and then I bought the, a white, like it came with a white one, but this one has a little bit of um, detailing on it, it's so, it's so nice, I think a medium, yeah, so it's 100% rayon, what? 100% polyester. No, I'm not too sure. <laughs> Anyways. And then I got this 
skirt. It's like shorts, but it looks like a skirt from the front. It's like a squat. Yeah, so cute. Oh, so pretty if you want to spend a little bit, like a little bit more. And it's all handmade, so it's all very, very cute. So if I'm going to Spain, that's what I'm saying. Anyways, I'm so hungry. Looking muffins. You can do anything like this. Slaps. Um, I'm gonna have a look on grab and I need to charge my. Oh. Oops. I'm gonna charge my camera because tomorrow's gonna be so long. And I have no idea what time I'm gonna get home. Bye. Anyways, I'll see you guys when I get something to eat. Oh my gosh, I need to remember to charge my camera too. Okay, I'm gonna do my skincare. It's actually a little cold. <laughs> it's windy, so I've got some pants on. I'll do a fit check. Just bring in my toner. I'm actually so sore. Like, <laughs> that session actually killed me. I don't know what the heck I did. So tomorrow is a super early start to the day. Going to back to the village tomorrow to prepare for the cremation on Thursday. Oh my god, my god. Get out of here. Um oh, ew. So the day starts at like seven. <laughs> it's crying for me. But we'll be back in snow bag four so I can try and I think I'll try an upper body tomorrow. Because I did a really lower body focus tomorrow. Do my steps and do all that jazz. Um bouncing drops. I feel like this is like low-key running out. I know it's not. I'm just being dry. This guy down there. Kids freaking looking at me. He's got his girlfriend right next to him. Um, girl, focus on. I mean, girl, focus on your girl. <laughs> I was walking out today and I saw this guy who looked so familiar and he kept looking at me and I was like, um, can you not? <laughs> Anyways, we're going out for dinner, I'm not too sure where. Um, somewhere along the beach. I'm so hungry. When I'm in Bali, I just get so hungry. I think because I'm eating properly, like I'm eating breakfast, lunch, and dinner. I'm not really snacking throughout the day, which is biceps. I'm not really snacking much throughout the day, which is really good. I'm really happy about that. I'm gonna get a haircut on Wednesday and do my hair. I'm just gonna shimmer this out. Went for a run this morning and it was just a so, I think it killed me. Anyway, so I'll show you guys the fit me turning you guys around. Pants are from Cotton On. Yesterday, and then got these glasses, and I'm gonna wear my Nike shoes. That's pretty much it. Let's get ready for dinner and just look how pretty. <sighs> Every day just makes me want to move to Bali more and more. So, one day. Off to the gym, and this is the fit. Keep that palm short, Alice Kitty, and then my air forces. I am honestly so freaking tired. I've been up since 4:40, 4:30-ish. I'm so tired, and this morning I was feeling like really good, and now I'm not. I think I'm just missing being around my friends because. I've been stuck with my mom and my brother for the past 
yeah, it's four days or whatever it is, I don't know. And I'm just like, ugh, I'm glad I can have my own time, but I don't know, I'm not feeling 100% the greatest. I'm gonna train legs today because I don't wanna train tomorrow. I wanna do a massage tomorrow and like sauna and ice bath tomorrow just to recover. Cause I have a really long day Thursday, so I don't really wanna be sore. So I'm not gonna go for a run tomorrow. I think I'll just do a walk. But yeah, I'm just tired and I'm a bit, <laughs> I'm a bit sad, but you know, maybe a workout will help. Just kick back some endorphins cause my best friend just landed in Spain and the time difference is fucked. <laughs> it's six hours currently now, so time is over there. It's 9.51 a.m. And then when I get back to Melbourne, it's an eight hour difference. So when it's like 8 p.m. for me, it's 12 p.m. for them. And I'm like, <laughs> great. So I'm just missing them because <laughs> I spend so much time with them. So I'm like, ugh. It's fine. I'm having a really good time though, so I'm just trying to enjoy my time here in Bali. I'm so grateful to be here. Not everyone gets to travel, so I'm super grateful for that. I'm so grateful I can travel and have financial freedom and be able to work from anywhere. But it's just hard to be separated. And like literally today I was thinking, I'm like, I'm so okay being alone, but I don't think I am. I don't know, maybe I should just book a flight to Spain. <laughs> I got like attachment issues. <laughs> Anyways, done. Enough with me ranting. I'm gonna go train. I'm gonna hit some endorphins up and go train some legs because I love myself. And you should love yourself too. Anyways, I'm gonna stop now and I'm gonna go book a grab and head out. I'm just at the gym. I finished off my session. I was really not wanting to um, film anything, I was feeling a little shit. Um, I still do feel like shit, but um, I just decided not to film. I just wanted to get it done and you know, complete what I could do. So I just did some hip thrust, uh, hyper extensions, abductors, some band work, cable kickbacks, and hamstring curls. Getting <laughs> ready to head into the hot and cold. But yeah, I'm like, ugh. I feel like a little bit shit. I do feel better than I did. Um, I think because I did train, then I like submerge myself in the cold water and just try and feel a little bit better. I, it's out, like, it's sunny now, so. <sighs> I do think I need an early night's sleep tonight. But let's get this done and then maybe I'll get a march hot to feel a bit better. day of this trip so I left here at 7 a.m. I only got back it's 9 a.m. 9 p.m. Fuck. <laughs> I slept the whole way back so I was so tired so today was like the big ceremony day it's called Naben which is like cremation so it's a funeral and it's like a um each section of like the village like it's all different and so they all do it differently and we went and spread the ashes at the river and it was just like it's just a long process like it's not like your typical like cremation or funeral back home in australia and then we said goodbye to all my family because i'm leaving on saturday 
sleepy. I'm so tired. <laughs> but I booked a flight to Spain <laughs> last night. <laughs> so I leave on Monday and I get back home from Bali on Sunday. So it's a lot of traveling. Hopefully I'll be okay, but super excited i'll talk more tomorrow about it because i'm so tired now i'm gonna go get food and then head to sleep all right love you guys i'll see you guys in the morning it is my last proper well, it's my last proper day Just did my last hot and cold. I was talking to these two really nice guys um, who live in Changru, but they are here in Samoa for the weekend. And they were so lovely. Originally from Christchurch. I think they're a bit older because he's been living here for 30 years. Yeah, just finished up. Hot and cold by myself. And yeah, that was the last one. I'm so hungry, so I think I might get something here to eat. Um, and then head back, do a little bit of work before heading out again for a late lunch slash dinner. But I'm so hungry now because I didn't really eat breakfast. So let's go do it and I really want to buy this bikini I saw and I think I'm just going to do it. <laughs> I mean I'm just going to do it. I don't care. It's so pretty. It's yellow and it looks so cute and I can take it to Europe. Alright. Let's go. Okay, I finished my dream session. I got a protein smoothie. It has soy milk, cinnamon powder, has vanilla vegan powder, and banana. It's 21.8 grams of protein and 288 calories. I also got the eggs my way. I got scrambled, of course. This has 12 grams of protein and it's 276 calories. You do the math. I didn't really eat much this morning, so I'm painting. Alright, I'm gonna eat this and then we're gonna head our way back to the hotel. Today is my, I guess, last day in Bali. I head home tonight. This trip has been so, so amazing. I have loved every single second. Um, and I'm really grateful to be a part of a massive family here. I was so grateful to be part of the Nub Band for my uncle. I wish him the most rest in peace. I don't really, really know what to say. And to everyone that had passed away in these few years, 
um, may them rest in peace and sending love to all of them and their family but yeah i had a really good time in bali i can't wait to come back i might i'm probably gonna be back here in six months for another ceremony with my mom so super excited bali is my home and it forever will be but i'm going to do some last minute stuff and head to the airport so i'll see you guys when i'm back at the airport to go to spain all right guys i love you all so so, so much and stay safe out there Thank you.